Hello, everybody. Welcome to a brand new series. We're going to be playing Stardew Valley. It is a brand new game. It's it's not a brand new game. It's a very old game. <laughs> it's a very old game by the way that YouTube works, really. It's been around for kind of a while. But I am a, I'm excited to play it. I'm itching to play something that fills kind of the role of Forger now that that series is gone. This is going to be a very comparable theming, like more relaxing style series for the channel. I don't know how long I'm going to play it. Could go on for a long time, but I'm just going to go in and have fun. Stardew Valley, if you don't know what it is, it's been out for a while, but if you don't know what it is, it's basically like Harvest Moon-ish kind of a game. So it's going to be a farming RPG. There's social elements. There's, you know, there's mining, mining, fishing, social elements, uh, all kinds of, obviously farming, stuff of that nature. And we're just going to go in and we're going to live our freaking life. We are Rito of Good Boy Farm and our favorite thing is indecision. Let's get a nice 360. Oh, pop on in. We're playing on the forest farm. I don't know what that means necessarily. And I picked the cat. I don't know how important those things are going to be, but we'll find out. And for my very special grandson. I want you to have this sealed envelope. That sword, you got a cutlass on the wall. What a guy. Holy moly. No, no, don't open it yet. Have patience. Have patience. Now listen close. Come closer. There will come a day when you feel crushed by the burden of modern life. And your bright spirit will fade before a growing emptiness. And the pause is long when that happens, my boy. My boy. You'll be ready. Then you'll be ready for this gift. Now let Grandpa rest. XX years later. XX years later. Joja, join us. Thrive. Holy moly. Is that us down there? Is that supposed to be a terminate? Oh my goodness. Smile, you're with Joja. Look at that. That's some Amazon logo up there. I I recognize that. Ooh, little hand. Life's better with Joja. Oh my. There we are. And the comedically oversized desk with the comedically oversized computer. We feel empty. We feel small. Oh, look, we're on a computer. That is a square mouse right there. Dear Rito, if you're reading this, you must be in dire need of a change. The same thing happened to me long ago. I lost sight of what mattered most in life. Real connections with other people and nature and making buku bucks on a farm. So I dropped everything and moved to the place I truly belong. I enclosed the deed to that place, my pride and joy, Good Boy Farm. It is located in Stardew Valley on the southern coast. It is the perfect place to start your new life. This was my most precious gift of all, and now it's yours. I know you'll honor the family name, my boy. Good luck and good boy. Love, Grandpa. P.S. If Lewis is still alive, say hi to the old guy for me, will ya? Okay. Thanks, Gramp. We are out of this Amazon-esque office. Getting on the next bus to Good Boy Farm. Dang, look at him. I, gosh, the background is so nice looking there. Just so pleasant. So freaking pleasant. Oh, this game is absurdly, absurdly relaxing. I do have experience with this game. I must be upfront and honest right now. This is not my first encounter, not my first rodeo. I, uh, I have for a while been watching my girlfriend play this game. <laughs> like, sometimes we'll go like every single night playing and I, I just watch. I kind of, I'm in the, every night I'm in the role of you right now. And now it's my turn to take the reins and be the Stardew Boy. Hello. 
Hello, you must be Rito. <laughs> I'm Robin, the local carpenter. Mayor Lewis sent me here to fetch you and show you the way to your new home. He's there now, tidying things up for your arrival. The farm's right over here, if you'll follow me. It's a dump. This is Good Boy Farm. <laughs> Fair enough. What's the matter? Sure, it's a bit overgrown, but there's some good soil underneath that mess. With a little dedication, you'll have it cleaned up in no time. It's a, probably a bad time to say that I have little dedication. Now, we're going to make this place tip-top, ship-shape, tip-top ship-shape. And here we are, your new home. Your new home. It's me, Robin. Ah, the new farmer. I don't know why this is my voice, but... I haven't had to be a voice actor in a while. Welcome, I'm Lewis, mayor of Pelican Town. You know everyone's been asking about you. It's not every day that someone new moves in. It's quite a big deal. Nobody leaves. It's a big deal that you came here. Nobody wants to come here. So you're moving into your grandfather's old cage. I mean, cottage. It's a good house. Very... Rustic. Rustic? That's one way to put it. Crusty, crusty might be a little bit more apt, though. Prude! Crusty? <laughs> nice, crusty house. I, I definitely talk about my house the same way I talk about my old food. Don't listen to her, Rito. She's just trying to make you dissatisfied so that you buy one of her house upgrades. Oh. <gasps> It's a good strategy. We'll see if it pans out. Anyway, you must be tired from the long journey. You should get some rest. Tomorrow you ought to explore the town a bit and introduce yourself. This is what we do in the beginning of these games, so the townspeople would appreciate it. Smell you later. Oh, I almost forgot. If you have anything to sell, just place it in this box here. I'll come by during the night to collect... I'll come by during the night to collect it? I know that some of these nights can... You can go to bed as late as, like, 2 a.m. in this game. You coming over to my house and taking all my stuff out of my box at 2 a.m., Lewis? Well, good luck. Bye, Lewis. Uh, okay. Good deal. Ooh, 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 ooh. We have begun our life anew. Oh, this is a nice... Go yep. <laughs> Let's get to time to be realistic here. Am I trying to be myself in case... Yes, let's go back. Let's go back to bed. How does one... Okay, parsnip seeds. You received five... Fifteen. Wow, this is going to be a great series. Fifteen parsnip seeds. Here's a little something to get you started. All right. Getting started. If you want to become a farmer, you have to start with the basics. It sounds... Why does that sound like a start of a song? If you want to become a farmer, you have to start with the basics. Use your hoe to till the soil, and then use a seed packet on the tilled soil. So crop. Water every day until the crop is ready for harvest. Cultivate and harvest a parsnip. Ugh. No, I don't want to talk to people. It'll be a nice gesture to introduce yourself around town. Some people might be anxious to meet the new farmer. Maybe the new farmer's anxious to meet the new people. Okay, let's redecorate. Gotta make this place my own. Great. I don't like this. I don't understand this at all. Okay, so we can only put it on... <laughs> I am a magic man. You know what? Nope. Can we put the TV on here? Oh, this is... This game is so... Getting on my nerves already. Put it on the TV? Alright. Well, I can't make this my own home. Let's put the... Uh... I can't even center it. Alright. I give up. I give up. So, we got a whole bunch of tools. We got ourselves an axe to chop down trees. And it is a bad axe. Oh my goodness. Got a bunch of sap, got a bunch of wood. We also have a hoe to till the soil. A pickaxe. We can break rocks or until the soil. I don't know. It looks like a couple things might break. I don't know what <laughs> everything that breaks the grass, but I guess hoe, pickaxe, scythe. Alright, good deal. 
Got to clear this out so we can harvest some snips. Some parsnips. Getting all kinds of fiber. All right. Can we run? We can walk. It's not the, uh, that's not quite what I was... It's <laughs> maybe the opposite of what I was talking about, but okay. How shall we do it? Let's... We need to... How many? 15? Just, we just need one? I can make one parsnip in my sleep. Guess we don't really have to do it like that, I don't think. Just because this is how other people do it doesn't mean we have to do it that way. So how many is that? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. I hate it. Thanks, I hate it. I was trying to be kind of cute with it, but no. Ugly. Uh, okay. We got 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 16. It makes no sense, but I'm going to do it that way. And then plant, 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 plant. I need one more parsnip seed. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm going to be bothered. Okay, we got some mixed seeds. There we go. Mixed seeds. There's a little bit of everything here. Plant them and see what grows. So we're going to grow parsnips and we're going to go grow one mystery thing. Or we can even like, oh, oh, I'm going to get real stylish here. Watch me accidentally make some kind of, like, cult symbol. That is exactly what's going to happen here. Water it all. We are a good boy on the good boy farm. So it's not going to... I don't think it's going to look that great when it actually starts growing because the mixed seeds, unless they start growing parsnips, I don't know if it's possible or not. There we go. How long did it say parsnips take? I did not look. Got to water the mailbox, everybody knows. So we, what do we got here? We got our inventory, we got our skills. Rito, the newcomer. We are not social and we don't know anyone. It is a very realistic game. We can make some gates, we can make some wood fences, a wood path. The boy's going to start making it look nice pronto. I cannot even live for a second. Can we... Oh! Unless we, uh, we make it look nice. I will not stand for an ugly home. I don't like it. What happens if we do this? Okay, that works. That works. There. It... <laughs> it'll have to do. Until we get more hood. But I'll take it for now. It's the start of something. I just want to... We don't want to start off with an ugly home and always have an ugly home. We want to beautify. Chop down the baby trees. Destroy all life. Destroy all life. Should we go talk to somebody? We can do whatever we want. But I think we should probably talk to somebody. After we make a prettier fence. Oh, a cobblestone path. Sounds kind of cute, too. Kinda, kinda cute. I hate it. Oh, I hate it. Let's keep going. We'll, we'll keep it there for now. Maybe if I... <laughs> this is... Get ready, guys. We are gonna be doing a whole series of make, making things just slightly different so that they are slightly more aesthetically pleasing. Get ready to relax with Rito Ross. I'm gonna make a happy little wood path. Just a happy little wood path. I don't like it. And that's okay. Not everything has to be great. Not everything has to be great. Just it, eventually it has to be great. All right, you know what? <laughs> After we finish this clearly, like, I clearly have an idea here. Let's finish it up and then we'll go and talk to somebody. I am running out of energy. 
already. I'm doing a bad job. We have 270 energy. If we run out, we walk really slow, I think, for like the rest of the day. So I'm going to not do that if I can swing it. One, two, three, four. It's something. It's definitely something. Is it a good something? Remains to be seen. Ha! We got up here again. Is this the... There's a bus that is out of service? Bus is out of service. The bus is out of service, guys. Everybody knows that. Everybody knows that. We don't We don't even ask anymore. Oh, we can press the little buttons to go. Oh, you! It is a pleasure to meet you. I'm Harvey, the local doctor. Have some sap. I think I'm allergic to this. Do you want some more? Have some sap. Have some sap. Yuck, what is this? Okay. Oh, a stranger. <laughs> oh, yay. He's so happy. My name is Vincent. Mama says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay. Okay. I seem okay. Just okay? If you don't watch your mouth, I'm gonna sap your shoes to the ground. Oh, or you aren't exactly how I imagine. But that's okay. I'm Jody. It's a quiet little town, so very it's very exciting when somebody moves in. Having a farmer around could really change things. No other farmers here. Hello! You must be Rito, the new farmer. I'm Carolyn. My husband runs the general store here, and have you met my daughter Abigail? She's the one the pale one with the purple hair. Is this your daughter? Why, hello and welcome to our little community, dear. You can call me Granny if you'd like. It smells awful. <laughs> it smells awful. <laughs> Ooh, I can read it on your face. I have the same voice as the granny. You're gonna love it here in Pelican Town. If you are ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. Flirting with me? Can't sit on the bench? Oh, aren't you the one who just moved in? I'm Maru. I've been looking forward to meeting you. Oh. Least aggressive and, like, most pleasant response so far. You know, with a small town like this, a new face can really alter the community dynamic. It's exciting. You're, you're on the top of my list right now. We can find someone to eventually be trolled. Hello! Absolutely <laughs> hate this. We are indeed making things harder for ourselves later, but that is a future Rito problem. Oh, hey! You're the new guy, huh? Cool. Yes, I am. See you around. Okay. Can I check your mail? I can't check your mail. Nothing is posted today. High quality seeds only at Pierre's. Louis's birthday's on the 7th. Boy's birthday's on the 10th. Egg festival. I will not be attending. Haley's birthday. Pam's birthday. Shane's birthday. Pierre's birthday. Emily's birthday. Flower dance. Hello, you are the one with the purple hair. Hello, Abigail. Oh, that's right. I heard someone new was moving into that old farm. It's kind of a shame, really. I always enjoyed exploring those overgrown fields by myself. It's a shame you're here, too. I don't like anybody. Hey, I'm Sam. Good to meet you. There we go. That's a normal human response. He, has, he doesn't even have anything more to say. Just a nice, simple, brainless little man. Nothing wrong with that. Hello. I am your show. I am Rito from Retromation on YouTube. I am now on your television. Let me switch it to twitch.tv slash Retromation. Hmm, it's irritating to have to meet all these new people, huh? I'm trying to catch up on the esports. Name's George, by the way. Now buzz off. Hmm. 
If I had a prized possession, I would give it to you. But I don't have anything of value right now. Don't know you. Who are you talking to me? Incredibly fair. This is mine? This is mine now. I live here now, squatter's rights. Can go in without them being there? We Zelda style now. All right, whose house is this? Whose house is this? Good evening. Is it evening? It, where has the time gone? So, how was your first night in the old cage cottage? <laughs> Ooh. Your grandpa used to complain about the rickety old bed, but I think deep down he loved the pain. Hey, Lewis. Stardew Valley. It's gonna turn out to be. Where's the Where's the mod that turns it into like one of those towns where you, as you learn more, you uncover the deep dark secrets of Stardew Valley. Hello. You can see them breathing, and it's strange to see pixels breathe. Hold on. All games are pixels. Hold on. Oh, you're the new farmer boy, aren't you? Hi, I'm Haley. If it weren't for those horrendous clothes, you might actually be cute. I will take that half compliment. But I cannot change my clothes ever, as far as I'm aware. So... I'm going to rummage through your trash and yours. So we are in a bright pickle, then, if we could only be cute with new clothes. We talk to you. Who are you? You're Jody. <laughs> I hate this. All right. See, I don't think it can show negative love, but we can just assume that it's everybody. Everybody who's got the gift by their name. All right. But we will stop doing that because I think you can maybe have negative relationships with people, or at least it's going to make it very, I think it's harder to eventually be on their good side. But oh well. I think I am going to get back home and head off to bed in just a moment here. Anybody hanging out up here? Oh. Oh. Concerned ape, I need to have a chat with you. Rito just wants to play at the park at 8, 10 p.m. All alone. After giving half the town sap. Why are you not giving into my fantasy? I thought this game was supposed to be fun. All right, well, let's go to bed. Right? 8.40? It's a little early for me, but I'll, I'll go with it. Anything to sell? Probably not yet. I don't think we need to bother with with that yet. It's so dark in here. Do we have a lamp? Ooh, cozy. Don't have any decorations I can make, do I? The torch? Doesn't seem safe. Allows you to pass through a fence. Oh, we should probably make a... We can maybe do that tomorrow. Let's go to bed. Pop on to sleep. Good morning, Stardew Valley. The sun is shining. The Rito's cute, but will never fully be realized because of his clothing. Hello there. Just got back from a fishing trip. You should come down to the beach sometime. I've got something for you. Willie. Willie. We should explore a farm. All right, water the crops. Ah, what a lovely day. Lovely day to be a farmer today. Oh, this is nice. Oh, this is nice playing with mouse and keyboard. Oh, I like it. Ooh, I like it. When I've dabbled with it, with, with it in the past, it's been on, uh, on the Switch of the Nintendo variety. And while it is nice, and I like it a lot, I've got to say... I am taking to the mouse and keyboard controls quite well. I like it. So we got a lot of water here. A lot of stuff we gotta get rid of. Go down here too. 
I mean, we might as well go down to the dock, right? Pop on over. Hello, it's locked. Nobody else locks their homes. Why do you? Are you paranoid? You heard about the sap man? What am I doing? Where is anybody? Where does anybody live in? I don't even... Uh... There's a map. Can I get there with M? I can! Uh... Sewer pipe. Wizard's tower, yep. Gotta get my gift ready. Maybe he has use for sap. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna get on a wizard's bad side. That is a surefire way to become a newt. Surefire way to become a newt. Okay. Not daunting and scary at all. Not foreboding. One uh, one little bit. A wizard. There we go. That is a wizard tower. It's locked. You can hear someone inside, though. Excuse me. Why are you closed? All right. Well, great. I'm glad. I'm happy to waste my time. Auto run. Always show tool. Hit location. What's that volume? Crank it. Window borderless. Menu backgrounds. What? Lock toolbar. What is all of this? Use hardware cursor. No. There's so many options. Oh, that's controls. We don't mess with those. Oh! No. Dialogue typing sound. All right. I like all these. These are great options. And I agree with the current settings entirely. Let's go to the beach. How do we get to the beach? I think we go this way. I feel like there's another house over here that we missed, though, right? Yeah, right here, right here. Leah. It's also locked. There's a child. Children love sap. Children love- get back here! Oh! Ew, this is icky. Well... Nice to meet you, too. Ungrateful. The trash. <laughs> Get a dig through the trash? She didn't even care. Got the sewer. Can we go in there? I mean, we... Giving everybody sap and digging through trash, we kind of probably should just move our home to the sewer, don't you think? Well, eh. Ahoy there, son. Heard there was a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet you. Oh, it's you. <laughs> I'm still trying to unwind. From a month out at the salty seas. It was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Here, I want you to have my old fishing rod. It's important to me that the Arto fishing stays alive. And hey, maybe you'll buy something, 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 something from my shop once in a while. Why do you have toxic waste? You received a bamboo pole. <laughs> Just a piece of bread or something. There's a good water. <laughs> There's good water here in the valley. All kinds of fish. Oh yeah, my shop's back open now. Come by if you need supplies. I'll also buy anything you catch. If it smells, it sells. <laughs> That's why I sell stuff. That's why I, my old pappy used to say. Sounds good, dude. Back to smoking your pipe. Staring off. All right. And this mysteriously as he arrived, he vanishes. Hey, dude. Trout soup, bamboo pole. We already got one. Should I spend half of my money on trout soup? I have not eaten in, a, in like, almost 48 hours. 
So that increases my fishing skill in addition to filling up my energy. Let's go fishing. Guys, get ready. Best fisher, fisherman on YouTube.com. Pro Bass Fishing 2019. Do they still make those? Joke's on you. It's actually this game. Oh, this is easy. Did it. Perfect. Oh. Hey. Hey. You wanted something smelly? Have a smelly fish. $37. 37 big boys. All right. I just had to do it. You know, like, when somebody gives you a gift and, and you're like... You know they want you to, to prove that you used it to them at some point. That's what I just did right there. It's like, look, I use your pole. What is this? It's a cockle. But of course. Only Elliot's friends can enter and uninvited. I wanted to give you my cockle. It's a it's a precious precious gift I found on the ground. I didn't know what it was. Looking for somebody. To give my cockle to doodly do. Who wants my cockle? Doodly do. <laughs> oh, hi, I'm Clint. He doesn't even... I'm the town blacksmith. If you never need to upgrade your tools, please don't come back. I don't think we want to buy anything yet. Upgrade tools? Probably not. What are we at? How many stinkers have we talked to? Also, we should probably get more use out of our fishing pole, considering we spent half of our money on soup that made us ding-dong fish good. It's algae. Of course, that's what I want. Fishing in the valley, doodle doo. I wanna catch a fish. How about you? Please. Oh, oh no, no, no. Pro Fisher, what are you doing? There we go. There we go. Saved it. Saved it. Saved it. Saved it. Nice. 14 for a small... Oh, no. You can throw away the algae. <laughs> and that's enough fishing for me today. We'll go just... We'll worry about fishing later. Now I have a fish to give somebody. Somebody's gonna want a fish. Looking for somebody, give my fish to Doodle Doo. Hello? No. I need somebody. I need somebody to give a fish to. Hello, sir. Greetings, I'm Demetrius, local scientist and father. <laughs> I want to introduce myself. If I've ever become a father, I want to say, Hello, I'm Rito, local father. Thanks for introducing yourself. He's so analytical and... I'm studying the local plants and animals from my home laboratory. Have you met my daughter, Mario? She's interested in to meet you. I have. Would you like a shell? That was very thoughtful of you. It's my first good gift. Do you love me? He's at the top. Vincent's at the top. I definitely gave him sap. Maybe he can't go negative. All right, let's go meet one more person. I think we got one more right up here. We do, we do. It's this bunny. You look like a man who could appreciate a good fish. We'll talk to him first. A stranger. Hello. Don't mind me. I just live out here alone. A gift? How nice. You can go inside your tent. 
Squatters rights. This is, you know, he really makes the most of it, you know, as far as, as, far as tents go. Doing a pretty good job. What the hell is this? Railroad. If you say so. I don't know. I think we can get stuff by clicking everything. I don't know. I'm going to do it regardless. Does this take us home? Country roads? Too good boy farm? No. Alright. We don't have a cat. I thought we picked a cat. When do we get the cat? Cat, 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 cat. Alright. Shall I adjust this? How would it look? Man, this is just getting too too into it. But welcome to Stardew Valley. Buckle up. I really hate it. Boy, I hope I can break it. You know, it's better than I thought. I wish I could get rid of this little stuff down there, but... Oh, well. In the meantime... What the hell was that? You got gremlins on my farm? Got farm gremlins. Oh, good aiming. Good aiming. Good aiming. I feel like we're going to need to clear out this space pretty soon here. We could have bought some parsnips and stuff. You know, in fact, we really probably should have bought some stuff from the shop, but we'll do that in the next episode. For now, let's clear out this garbage. You are the last casualty of the day. And then we will move on to Slumberland. All right. You know what? I like this symbol. I hope it's not evil. Can we? <laughs> so stupid. Just in case I forget where the TV is. <laughs> it looks so bad. Go to sleep for the night. It's 6.30, but, you know, I think I, I think I'd need to. Look at this. There. Just in case I forget. We have to... What? We can't... Oh, we got rid of the only useful thing there. <laughs> I guess we could put it, like, perfectly in front of the door. Oh, weird. All right. Well, I'm going to put it bizarrely right there. No, I hate it too much. All right. Good night. Thank you for watching. This has been the inaugural episode of Stardew Valley, and I am very, very excited to get back to it. I hope you guys are excited about this series. If you are, the best way to make sure a series sticks around is to let me know in the comments. To like it is... It does stuff. If you just tell me in the comments and are generally around and supportive, I'll, you know, I'll know that you guys like the series. If you want to talk to me directly, you have anything you want to tell me about the game, stuff like that, pop into the Discord. There will be a link in the description. You can either talk about Stardew Valley, you can talk about other games on my channel, just talk about my channel, talk about whatever the hell you want down there. And if you want major updates, you can even follow me on Twitter. I hate to do all this plug stuff, but, you know, it's the first episode. This is where it makes sense to do this kind of garbage. <laughs> I'm on Twitter, RetromationYT, and I'm on Twitch, Retromation on there. Twitch.tv slash Retromation. I stream games live. Let me know if you want to see Stardew Valley live or something like that. Hit me up in the comments below. Thank you for watching, though. Subscribe for more. See you next time.